10 gigawatts is like $400 billion, right? Yeah. Something like that. And that $400 billion will have to be largely funded by their offtake, their revenues, right. which is growing exponentially. It has to be funded by their capital, the right. money they've raised through equity, and whatever debt they can raise. Those are the three vehicles. And the equity that they could raise and the debt that they could raise has something to do with the confidence of the revenues that they could sustain. For sure. And so smart investors and smart lenders will consider all of these factors. Fundamentally, that's what they're going to do. That's their company. It's not my business. And of course, we have to stay very close to them to make sure that we build in support of their continued growth. And so um, there's the revenue side of it, and it has nothing to do with the investment side of it. The investment side of it is not tied to anything. It's an opportunity to invest in them. And as we were mentioning earlier, this is likely going to be the next multi-trillion dollar hyperscale company. And who doesn't want to be an investor in that? You know, my only regret is that, that uh, they inv invited us to invest early on. If we're so poor, we didn't invest enough. You know, and I should have given them all my money.